family, a family camping trip. I'm gonna name every squirrel and eat every dangerous kind of oak. We're not camping, Mabel. This is a scientific expedition. We're searching for leftover multi-dimensional rips from Weird Mageddon, a patch with alien adhesive. So keep an eye out for anything that seems Lovecrafty. Great Uncle Ford, what was it like in the multiverse anyway? Confusing. One minute you're breathing air, the next you're breathing fingers. Think you found a sandwich? It's a planet. You just ate a planet. Multiverse tips. Don't eat planets. Got it. Just be careful where you point that nerd gun, Brainiac. We need these kids back on the bus in three days, and I want them going home in one piece. Stanley, under your watch, the twins fell into a bottomless pit. I'm not sure you should be giving caretaker advice. What? I'm the best caretaker ever! I've taught these kids valuable life lessons, like how to hotwire cop cars. What's Dipper's real name? Diphthalamu, I don't know. Bottom line, I could caretaker circles around you. Hey, Grunkle Stan, this oak makes my face feel funny. Not now, sweetie. Psst. Hey, Dipper, guess who I brought along? <laughs> Mabel, didn't you hear Ford? This is a dangerous mission. Aw, oh, come on. This gal needs some one-on-one -on -one pig time before summer's over. Mabel, I know you don't want to hear this, but don't you think you're being a pinch self-centered? What? I'm the least self-centered person. Trust me, it's scientifically proven that every adventure is better with a pig. Right, Waddles? Waddles! I walk these kids like a hawk. Nothing gets past me. Found my pig. Stay back! Who's your little guy? You are good! Ah, I mean, grab my thing! Mabel! Lord, do something! Good thing I wore my infinity belt! Stanley, grab hold of me! Bad things are happening right now, guys! Whatever you do, don't let me! Ah! Go! Mabel, no! here, Brain Bull, tried to invent a dimensional escape pod, but she's been too busy working on her sticker collection to finish it. What? I mean, I love stickers as much as the next Mabel, but what about home? I bet if we work together, we can get that puppy up and running. Sorry, I totally lost my train of thought when you said puppy. Who said puppy? Puppy? Where? I want to pet a puppy. Mabel! Mabel, sweetie! Come out, I've got some candy for you! And I'll give you some delicious vitamin supplements! 14 kinds of zinc! You don't know anything about Mabel, do you? Of course I do! I scanned her entire molecular structure the day I came here. 
Guess how many enzymes she has. Huh. The answer might surprise you. Sixer, I swear if I lose my niece... Stanley, trust me. We'll find Mabel. I know the multiverse. Mabel! Keep looking! Rainbow, please! I have to get back home! I just escaped one worm again, and I don't need another one! Chillax, she'll get around to it when Evs. What a hack, some sack. I do not appreciate your laid back attitude, Maybro! These Mabels are driving me cravel! The stands can't get here soon enough! Finally, a normal one! Oh, hey, which Mabel are you? They haven't given me a name yet, thank goodness. I don't know why they think everyone needs one. Sounds like you're anti label, Mabel! No, I'm just a regular Mabel, like you! Listen, there's a way out of here, but I don't trust these other whack jobs to work together with me. Some of these other Mabels seriously creep me out. Hey! Stanbo is single and ready to mingle! <laughs> you got friends searching for you, right? We need to send a signal to them. Military expert Mabel has a flare gun, but she says it's for emergency raids only. You distract her, I'll steal it, and together we can get back to our home dimension. I like the way you think, Mabel. That's because I think like you, Mabel. Eh? Eh? This distress beacon will either summon an interdimensional good Samaritan or an unimaginable beast that feeds on fear. I like those odds. <laughs> well, entangle my particles. What are you apostrophe backslashes doing out here in the multi-sticks? Looking for the best grandniece in the multiverse. You seen her? Maybe I have. But I never let a known criminal onto my truck. My criminal record made it into space? Gotta admit, I'm kind of impressed with myself. I was talking about him. Your wanna posters are everywhere from here to La of Grand Night. <laughs> <laughs> are you serious? Mr. Goody Nerd chooses a criminal out here? Look, I might have stolen a few hundred parts to build my quantum destabilizer, but it was all in the name of science. How's about we leave him cuffed in the back and I sit in the front? Damn! What? So I says, dark matter? More like dark matter! <laughs> Brilliant! I hate this. So there I was, surrounded by bodies. I won the war, but I have lost my soul. And I was all like, oh. Oh, totally. Totally! Been there. Oop, gotta go. Mabel biz. So yes, sir! I hope this works! Sticks! The heck! You and me! What a pair we are! There she is! Quick! Head towards that exploding child! We did it! Ha -ha! Mabel's for the win! Gonna be a long trip back! Need a bathroom break? Good thinking, me! I am so considerate! Be right back! Hey, wait, what are you doing? Ward's here to rescue us. Correction, he's here to rescue me. You're stuck here, idiot. What? You think I want to be trapped in this godforsaken maypole listening to these nitwits talk about boys and glitter for all eternity? I don't even like glitter! W what kind of Mabel are you? The exact kind of Mabel you aren't. And considering how easy it would be for me to guess this, You'll probably never figure it out. You're... you're the exact opposite of me. You're... the anti-Mabel! Ding, ding, ding! I was chased out of my dimension for being the most evil Mabel in the multiverse. I have no home to return to. That's why I'm going to leave with your uncles and take over your life, and there's nothing you can do about it. Mabel, no! Mabel, yes! Woof! You think you can find your girl among all these Google acts? Why, of course I... I... Oh, dear. Can't recognize your own niece. <laughs> Who's the bad caretaker now? Hey, Grunkles! Lol, I love pigs and sweaters. <laughs> I'm a goofball, wibble, wibble. That's her! No, no! This can't be happening! Everyone, quick! We have to stop that ship or I'm trapped here forever! Totally. I'll help right after I finish my cottages. Right, meow -boo? Can't talk, chase your tail. <laughs> go, go, go. What's wrong with you guys? This is an important mission and you're all just being totally self-centered. Oh. oh, Mabel.
Mabel. You gotta work on yourself. Attention, Mabels of Mabe 3L! I used to be just like you! So caught up in my own Mabelness that I neglected those around me! Heck, I caused an entire apocalypse just to get one more day of summer! Crikey, you gotta be pulling out wallabies, mate! I'm afraid it's true, Gadable. I'm going to be better, but in order to do that, I need to get back home! My ride is leaving, and if you help me catch it, I promise I'll never be selfish again! Now, I know it's a long shot, but does anyone here have a grappling hook? Don't you ever scare me like that again, pumpkin! Apologies, dearest uncle. I will not transgress your laws again. Haha! <laughs> transgress! Classic Mabel! Psst! Stanley, something seems... off about Mabel. Oh, here we go! You're just jealous that I was able to pick her out of a crowd, and you weren't! Great Uncle Stanford, do you have any futuristic mega weapons that I could bring home with me? Uh, for educational purposes? Yes. Over there by the airlock. Don't move! Have you lost your mind?! My alien adhesive! I wanted to do this the easy way, guys. I really did. We were all going to go home as one happy family. But I guess I'll have to tell Dipper you two were lost in space! Looking forward to my new dimension, by the way. Been hankering for a new civilization to overthrow. Mabel? Sweetie? I think maybe you've had too much sugar. I'm not Mabel! Dang it, Stan! You got the wrong one! Oh, you are loving the chance to throw this in my face! Sounds like you two need some space! Endless space! What is that? <laughs> Looks like the Mabels have turned! I don't get it. Now give me back my Gruggles! You want them? Come and get them! This shooting star shoots back! Mabel ah! back! Take that, Mabel! Don't let them take me alive! Stop the great <laughs> You got me bad, Mabel. I think I'm going to visit that big Mabel <coughs> in the sky. Don't you die on me, military expert Mabel. Not on my watch. I have a pig at home. Tell him. <coughs> Tell him he's a cute little guy. Mabel, to the rescue. Yes, rescued by mouth, just like in my dreams. This is dumb. All of this is dumb. I can't feel my legs. Had enough? You! I'll knock the glitter out of you, you giggling punchline! I'd like to see you try. Look a puppy! Where? What's going on? Which one's the real Mabel? Uh, I can't tell. They're equally adorable. Welcome to Sweater Town! Why does this always happen with doubles? There was only some way to tell them apart. Wait, wait, it's not what it looks like. You think you've defeated me, but I'm a part of you. Every selfish choice you make, that's being just like me. What do you have to say to that? This is for military, Mabel. That glue sealed my wounds, soldier. Thanks for everything. With this ship, we can find our various home dimensions. I can't wait to see my dipper again. Me too! Me three! I'm a table. Later, Mables! Don't do anything I would do! <laughs> well, I guess we're both terrible caretakers. Rescued by our own niece. I don't know how we'll live this down. Hey, for what it's worth, I love you both. But maybe the reason you two can't take care of kids is that you kind of still are kids. Maybe it's time for you to take care of each other. Ha <laughs> ha! Take that, multiverse! This is how we do it in Jersey! Pines, pines, pines! I can't believe you got to go to the multiverse! What was it like? Real stupid. But the stupidest part was me. I guess what I wanted to say is... I'm sorry for being selfish this summer. I guess it took me dealing with myself to realize what you put up with. <laughs> okay, 
Who are you and what have you done with Mabel? I shot her out of an airlock. Oh, I also got something for you from someone named May Bipper. She said I could have it. What? This is for me? It's time for us to start some new adventures. And this time, I won't always hog the spotlight. Also, if you ever see someone who looks exactly like me but hates rainbows,